Hey, fatty. Eating fat is making you fat and sick, you fat pig. Okay, you idiots don't even know what a true carbohydrate is. Everything you're eating that you think carbs is full of fat. It only takes a tiny bit of fat to destroy a good carb. Fat is making you fat. Okay, at this point, the literature, if you want to get into the science, the literature is undisputable. Okay, the healthiest diet on the planet is a low-fat diet. Period. Period. Okay, all your zero-carb carnivores, zealots can cherry-pick whatever they want. The science is indisputable, and the anecdotal evidence is insane. Like, every lean person on the planet is eating a low-fat diet. Every lean person on the planet is eating a low-fat diet. Just because in North America you're brainwashed, you're brainwashed by all these zero-carb zealots and you have sugar phobia. Okay, Eric Bergler has got you scared out of your wits. Okay, you're a sugar phobe. You're a sugar phobe. You're an idiot. Pure sugar is healthy. It can change your life. Cranks your metabolism up. People keep asking about, what if I have type 2 diabetes? Walter Kempner was reversing type 2 diabetes over and over and all sorts of other health issues with a diet that was pure sugar. Rice, juice, pure table sugar for years. It's nothing new. Okay, reverses insulin resistance. Fat causes insulin resistance. As soon as you start eating fat-free carbs, your glucose tolerance goes through the roof. Lean meat, not fatty meat, dummy. Okay, the fats would screw up everybody's digestion. People are so paranoid about their gut problems think it's caused by sugar. It's because the fat you're eating in the carbs, you idiots. Okay, there's one thing for certain. You're never going to run from carbs. Your body wants the sugar. Okay, your body needs next to no fat. Microdose amounts of fat. Sugar gives you energy out the ass. Cranks your metabolism up. Makes you burn fat like crazy. Pure sugar with no fat in it. People cannot get this through their head. Okay, the fat is causing all your health problems, you idiots. All of them. Everything. You're a fat ass because of it, and being a fat ass causes all the health problems. Okay, makes you insulin resistant as all hell, having a bunch of fat in your diet. It makes your blood sugar stay elevated forever when there's fat in the diet. As soon as the fat is gone, the blood sugar comes up and goes back down. When it's pure sugar. Pure sugar via starch, fat-free, fruit, sugar, honey, table sugar. Okay, pure sugar. Okay, I love all these zero-carb carnivore zealots. When they're demonizing sugar, they're always putting up pictures of, like, ice cream and donuts. That isn't pure sugar. It's a bunch of fat, idiot. Fat is the issue. High fat diets suck. A strict low protein, low as hell. Like we're talking three to four to one protein to fat. Strict low protein ketogenic diet can be used as a short term therapy. One in 10,000 people. That's it. Okay, every single person on the planet should be cutting fat out of their diet. Whatever's in lean meat, okay? I'm not promoting veganism. Whatever's in the leanest meat. You don't need fatty ass meat, you idiots. The literature is completely indisputable at this point. Okay, if you're just in your little echo chamber, your little bubble, and you get these jackass doctors that are carnivore zealots, just giving you these cherry-picked studies is bullshit. Most of the literature is a complete crock of shit anyway. Especially the new stuff. Everybody wants their name out there. Try to get famous. The anecdotal evidence is undeniable. Wolf that diet. Wolf that diet. Not to mention a high-fat diet where you're cutting carbs. I know there's no sustainability. It's not even natural to eat it. That diet blows blows it's a crock of shit it's a gimmick that lazy people are attracted to quick fix bunch of bullshit when all you had to do from day one is just cut the fat out of your diet lean meat vegetables fruit starch a normal looking clean diet 
Until next time, I guess Ansel Keys was right, Addy. <laughs>